Hello, this is Bini here. In the earlier video that I did, which titled The Next Moving Market or Simply Another Cry Worth, I mentioned about China Polybureau July 2023 meeting and gave two price levels that Hang Seng Index and Hang Seng Tech must stay. As long as price can stay above 4170 I think that there should be continued momentum for the HS tech to continue to move up. Of course, there is a need to clear the resistance zone here, starting from 4,280. And of course, ultimately at this high here, which is 4,360. So two resistance level to remember, first would be about 4,280. So that's the immediate resistance. And lastly, the one that determines the breakout of Hang Seng Tech would be really around 4,350. This would be the high point here. I think that uh, we should monitor for at the end of the day, whether the market is, is buying this piece of news. Okay. So to know whether the market is buying this piece of news, we have to see that price stay supported, which means for Hang Seng Tech, it would be price must stay above 4,170, which is this level here. Okay, 4,170. For HSI, it would be around 19,000. That means price needs to stay above 19,000, right? Which is this high here in order to, you know, show that commitment that whatever that Polybureau said, the market believes. Today, this video, I would be looking into the two levels going forward, what's up for Hang Seng Index and Hang Seng Tech. The good news is that across in my watch list, that's the price feed, they are green. That means that today, despite it's a Friday, the Hong Kong market started off the week and towards the close of the afternoon session, prices are able to reverse. And this is a good sign. This is the Hang Seng Index chart. Let's visit some of the key levels that's mentioned. Here was the identified resistance and it seems that with today, the resistance has been cleared. That's a good thing. Zoom in to the key level that I was uh, waiting, which is uh, 19,000 level here. I've mentioned that price must never close below this level. We can see that after my video, price has been holding very well. And finally, yesterday, it broke above the key levels of 19,500. Today, it tried to, you know, close lower, deep lower, but eventually it still moved up. Now, quite convinced that Hang Seng Index had broken the 19,500. And then we'll be probably expecting a move towards this zone here, okay, which is about 20,000 or even 20,300 plus minus around this level. Now, in terms of some long-term target prediction, let me just give you that price level. Let's assume that the 20,000 key level, and that could be 20,200, 20,500, basically meaning that this whole zone here is broken. Then we would be looking into this price structure. So this would be the uptrust and that would be the retracement here. And in other words, we'll be looking at outcome and that's probably somewhere around this. So the outcome would be around here. So this is the whole retracement level and then this moves up would be equal to the outcome. Now, if this is true, then the minimum target I'm looking for if the 20,500 level has been taken out, then the minimum target I'm looking for would be this one here, which is 22,500. So we look forward to this level. But along the way, there would be some retracement, meaning that along the way, you probably would expect that price will hit this resistance and we're going to see whether the retracement would be supported and ultimately this key level would be broken again and then some form of retracement before finally hitting into the key resistance zone. Hang Seng Tech has also reached the initial target that I've talked about, which is this level here. So that's about 4,350. If we review in Hang Seng Tech, then price stayed very well above the 4,166 that I mentioned earlier. That's the teen little red line here and then gap up, hit into the resistance, which is the grey area. And today, finally, the good news is that it surpassed this resistance. It's known that Hang Seng Tech is a lot more bullish than HSI, which is Hang Seng Index. Again, let's take a look into the structure. If we are looking at this whole thing as an uptrust and this is a retracement, then we are looking at the movement up here as the 
resulting movement after the completion of the retracement. With today's movement, I think I'm quite sure there is going to be a weak close above the recent resistance. And this resistance was very strong. And the fact that it's being broken, right? Of course, we need to look into the day close, but looking at how price moved and that the intraday movement didn't retreat from the high, I'm quite convinced that we are going to have a clean break of this resistance here, which is about 4,350. The next target I'll be looking at would be this level here. So that's about 4,800 level. So this is the recent high. But one thing notable to bring out is there might be a sub level here that will cause a minor resistance into Hang Seng Tech. So in terms of a possible price movement might be, might be that we're gonna have a retracement to the support level. It might or might not happen. But the idea is that you know price would move to this interim resistance level that's about 4600 could do a bit of a retracement before that you need to watch whether there's a break towards the 4800 level so that's what i'm expecting here have you clicked the subscribe button and how about a like Right, if you would like to, let's say, trade into this price movement, so instead of buying into the stocks, but you just want to be involved in the index, then under the Singapore Exchange, there are listed structured products that you might want to explore. So let me just spend a quick 30 seconds to look into these structured instruments. What is the Daily Leverage Certificate? It is an exchange traded investment product that allows investors to take a bullish or bearish leverage exposure to an underlying asset such as an equity index or single stocks. This is right now a website of UBS where you can trade into Hang Seng Index for example. Select the Hang Seng Index or the Hang Seng Tech as the underlying and then search for the daily leverage products DLC that's relevant to your direction. In this case here, if you are considering to go long which is to buy then you should be looking at a daily long which is a daily long for Hang Seng Tech. I hope that this video is useful to you. Remember to hit the subscribe button and the like button so that you'll be notified real time instantly whenever I launch new video of stocks or index that you are interested in. If there's any other stocks that you would like me to talk about, do leave a comment here.